Hello, my name is Jana Smith. I am a Senior Account Manager Lead and Process Trainer at Guaranteed Digital. I will be going over the Guaranteed Digital Resource Center in two segments. Segment 1A, which is this training video, will go over a general overview of what you can find in the Resource Center. Segment 1B will be a more granular training session into the submission form, which will include the order desk, the RFP submission form, and the client insights form. The material and information in the Resource Center will help you in understanding the bundles, the services, as well as the sales material you can use. I highly recommend that you bookmark this page and reference often. As I indicated a few moments ago, the Submission tab will offer three drop-down options, which you will be using when filling out the necessary client information to start the fulfillment of services. I will be going over the request for proposal form, the new order form, and the client insights form. If you're looking for a more granular training of these forms, please reference my Segment 1B training video that can be found in the onboarding drop-down partner training page under process training. The first form I'm going to be going over to you today is the RFP form. The RFP form must be filled out when submitting for these four services. The on-page SEO, which is dependent on the size and platform, and if they want a monthly on-page optimization or a one-time. We have target marketing. That's dependent on what type of target marketing services the client would like, if they want creative, and how long the campaigns will run for. We then have the website option, mainly used for the custom WordPress platforms, but also used for our lead machine Wix Ascend platform, should they want to add an e-commerce component to their website. And lastly, we have the video spec ad request. This is a customized video branding video that will include specific logo, content, and images that the client, for the client-specific business. So in order to submit this form, you want to fill out the required fields, select which service that you are requesting an RFP for. Once that submission is filled out, we have three business days to get that proposal out to you. Once you accept that proposal and have the client sign off on it, you can then start filling out the new order form, which is the next form we'll be going over. The new order form is not only where you submit new orders, but it's also where you can renew target marketing, change an active target marketing campaign, or submit a cancellation. As indicated earlier, I will be going into a deeper dive into the forms in my second 1B training video. The last form we will be going over today is the Client Insights form. This is the form that must be set um, filled out and submitted prior to a kickoff call. The sales rep must have this form completed within 24 hours prior to the kickoff call with your scheduled account manager. We recommend that the sales rep fills this form out with the client and that this form gets filled out right after the sales rep, the sales order rather. If you don't know your account manager, you can leave it unknown as that is what the default is. Should you fill this out after you have an introduction to your account manager, you can then select from the list below here uh, and then select the account manager that has been assigned to the client's account. You will then want to select the services that the client has signed up for. Once you select these boxes, it will auto-populate the fields below. Once the submission form has been filled out and submitted, then the account manager will be able to review this information prior to the kickoff call. There will be about a three business day turnaround time from when you submit this form to when an account manager reaches out to you to schedule that kickoff call. Moving back to the GD Resource Center tabs here, we'll next be going to the onboarding tabs. The drop downs we'll be going over is the launch material, partner training and agency best practices. The launch materials page is where you can review seminar materials, sample contracts, guidelines, glossary of terms, 
as well as launch timelines and best practices for digital sales compensation plans and team structure. The partner training page is where you can find the virtual training decks, worksheets, and process training videos, which are many of the ones that I will be going over with you. Lastly here, we're going with the top 20 agency best practices. This is going to be a great resource to review suggestions for how to launch a digital agency sales effort within your organization. We're then going to move down over here to the product information. All of these drop-down tabs are great references that details what the services we fulfill, as well as any notes and details that you can review to help understand our process and our services. Moving on to the collateral drop-down, We'll be going over sales, webinars, and case studies. The sales tab is a great reference to learn what's new at Guaranteed Digital. This will include sales decks for all our services, industry-specific best practice sales decks, as well as examples broken down by industry. Moving on to the webinars page. This is a great resource where you can check out our training video. So you have the prospecting video and many of our product overview videos to watch. Lastly here, we're gonna to go to the case studies. This offers a variety of case studies broken up by services. Should you not see a case study in a particular industry or service, you can reach out to our management team at any time for that request. We then are moving on to the Fulfillment tab. The Fulfillment tab goes over the bundle and a la carte services and target marketing onboarding fulfillment form order submission to a kickoff call and frequently asked questions. Moving on to the Billing tab. This is a great reference if you have any questions about our general billing guidelines for our services, cancellations, billing rules, and reporting. This is further discussed in my expectations and turnaround segment three training video found under process training section of the partner training page in the GD Resource Center. Lastly here, we have the team contact information. This page shows all of your management team and contact information. So you can reach out to any one of our managers at any time if you have any specific questions. That concludes this high level training of the Guaranteed Digital Resource Center. Again, if you're interested in the deeper dive into our submission forms, then please check out our GD Resource Center submission forms segment 1B training video that can be found in the onboarding dropdown partner training page under process training. Thank you.